Hello, I'm Erin O'Connor and I'm a learning designer with the Faculty of Health at QUT. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Blackboard Twink for Image Map Link Mapper. Uh, an image map is a single image that has multiple clickable areas or hotspots. And here's an example from our Twink demo site. When a user of your Blackboard site clicks on one of these hotspots, they're directed to whatever you've linked to that image map. So here's an example. I'm going to click on link 1 and that takes me to another folder in Blackboard. Uh, the hotspots or the linked areas can be attached to another area in Blackboard. They can be linked to an external website or even a particular document that you want to show your learners. You can use these image maps in place of text only menus to engage students or to show the bigger picture. Um, so to create these image maps, you'll need to write a small amount of HTML or hypertext markup language. And this is basically a language used in the background of many web pages and online spaces. Don't get too worried if you haven't worked with HTML before. I'll show you an online image map editor, which will do a lot of the hard work for you. Or if you're pretty familiar with it, uh, feel free to use whatever particular programs you use um, to work through HTML. So in part one of this, I'll um, just show you a little, I'm just introducing you to it. In part two, I'll show you how to do that particular HTML writing. Um, if you're familiar with it, skip to part three where we'll work, look at how we use that HTML in the Blackboard environment. So first, you will need to have an image before you start these tutorials that suits your needs and is safe for you to use on your computer. Um, so it might be something that's held under Creative Commons that allows you to edit it or it may be an image that you own yourself. If you're not sure, talk to your learning design team about copyright and about your rights on that particular image. 